it's Dr. Meg here for Anatomy 101. Today my guest star is Dr. Aaliyah. She will be going over the internal of a fetal pig. <laughs> digestive system. Okay, so the digestive system starts up here with the epiglottis, which you can see right here. And we did not find the parotid glands or and the peritoneum. We just removed most of it, although you can see like some still attached on the sides and stuff. Um, and then the mesentery is what holds together the small intestines. And it's this like webby stuff that holds it all together there. The liver is this entire structure along here. It's really big. The gallbladder is underneath the liver. This is the umbilical cord, but the gallbladder is right here this little sac right there and then the cystic duct connects the gallbladder right here and the hepatic ducts are from the liver right here and they come together to form the common bile duct which is on the duodenum and the duodenum is this thank you this part here and we weren't able to completely find the common bile duct but it's on this part the stomach is this entire structure here we cut ours open to see the inside, but this entire structure is the stomach. The esophagus is not very visible, but it's under the trachea. This is the trachea, and it's back behind it. You can sort of see it right there. Right there. Um, the pancreas is underneath the stomach back here. It's this spongy kind of structure down here. The spleen is this right here. It's the kind of tongue-looking thing that uh, wrapped on top of the stomach. The small intestines are this entire section. As I mentioned, this beginning part of it, this little U-shaped, is the duodenum. And then it goes into the jejunum, which is this entire part. And when it connects to the large intestine, it connects at the ilium, which is this portion of it right here. And then the cecum is this little pouch that sticks off of the beginning part of the large intestine. And this whole thing is just the large intestine and the colon and everything. And then it ends and it goes into the rectum, which is this portion of it right here. And that's it for the digestive system. Stick with us and we'll show you the other system. Thanks for watching.